Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So this is the first part of my grocery haul for the week. Um, it is Friday, so I'm gonna show you a few things here. Then Saturday, I'm gonna finish up my grocery shopping and I will show you the rest of the haul. Um, as usual, stay tuned at the end of the video where, where I will have my meal plans and I will try to remember to also put it in the description box so that way it's all listed out and you guys can see that. And I'll also provide any links to any recipes. Um, most of my things though this week, I think are just, really light summer meals and I'm kind of making them up but if I have anything to link then I will and first I want to show you um, two like non food items um, these are a couple shirts that I got on a really great deal at JCPenney unfortunately by the time you see this the um, main part of the sale will be over which is they're having like a one day you get like an you get a little coupon when you come in and it's like a mystery sale and I got an extra 30% off but these are also 30% off right now. So this, these are normally $37. These are Liz Claiborne. Look at this color. So it's like a sleeveless shirt. So I can wear it sleeveless. And then like at work, I can wear one of my cardigans and it has like a shirt underneath because these are very sheer. But I really thought this print was really cute. I'm gonna wear like my dark blue cardigan with this. And then I thought this would look really good with my white cardigan but it's the same thing. These were both 37, but they were 30, no, they were $14.99 on sale, and then I got an extra 30% off, so I got both of these for $20.98, so great deal on that. So those are the non-food items. So I got a couple waters here. Actually, I ran out of water on my way to go shopping. Oh, I got all this from Costco and Safeway. Um, so, and then these JCPenney. <laughs> But I ran out of water, so I picked up a couple waters to drink on my travels. So I just picked up two of the Fiji waters. I don't know if I'd ever tried those before. And then they had the organic cage-free Eglin's Best. These were on sale for $2.99, so I thought that was a great deal. And I'm doing some egg muffin cups in meal prep for Sunday. So um, I wanted to get some extra eggs for those. I'm gonna have, it's gonna be like a variety of different egg muffin cups, so stay tuned for that picked up this from Costco these are my favorites these are the organic artesian um, romaine lettuces I'm gonna be actually having lettuce cups I uh, like for dinner one day this week so I like the, these for that plus just salads I picked up some avocado oil spray and I like to keep these on hand I prefer to use fresh limes and lemons but lately lemons and limes have been hard to find in my area every store has been out of lemons and I finally had to go to a store I never go to to find them last week um, so anyway I just like to have these on hand for um, when I do need juice and I just don't have one on hand so I have a lemon and a lime picked up some holy guacamole my husband will probably use this more than I will um, but it is two points for two tablespoons I just prefer to have smashed avocado myself but we're having like a taco night one day this week so um, I got this for that and the Costco samples got me these are the organic healthy choice fudge bars these are five points a piece I did open them so I could show you how big they are they're not that big I need to get them in the freezer but not terrible but I have a whole family to eat these so I'm not too worried about it but yeah five points so if I do have just that you know craving is so hot right now that I think that's why I just fell for it so easily my normal Asian cashew chopped salad. I'm gonna have um, Chinese chicken salads one day this week. Actually, I'm gonna do the wontons instead of chicken, but I'm gonna make put some extra stuff in there I don't normally put in there, so I picked up some of this for that, and that'll be for dinner one night. And then I got these last week too. These are the two, or a week before last. These are two um, eight, eight ounce packages, so it's a pound each, but they're in separate packages, so they stayed really fresh when I got them last time. Anyways, the organic mixed green, so this is really good just for salads. I picked up some of the organic French beans from Costco as well. I like to steam these, so that's what I'll be doing with these and having for lunches and dinners. I picked up some raspberries. These are going to be for, I'm going to be making a chocolate chia pudding for snacks this week. And um, it's like a protein chocolate chia pudding. Anyway, I thought the raspberries would be good on top of that. And then I picked up some reduced fat mozzarella cheese. I do prefer the reduced fat versus the fat free because this melts really well. And this is two points for a quarter cup. So I always try to save points, but if I don't have enough points, then I will use the fat free, but this is a reduced fat. So stay tuned on the next clip and you will see what I got from Fred Meyer. Okay guys, so here is the rest of the haul for the week. Um, as far as proteins, 
I only need to get some chicken. So I have some chicken tenders. I'm gonna be using this for a couple different recipes. Um, I have some ground turkey in the freezer, so that'll be the only other meat I need this week. Uh, I picked up some uncured black forest ham. I'm gonna be using this for my egg muffin cup recipe. I will be sharing with you guys tomorrow in meal prep. Um, I'm actually doing 12 different, no, six different egg muffin cup recipes. So stay tuned for that. So I need the uncured black forest ham for that. The rest of this will be for the family. It's gonna have chef salads one day. So that'll be for the rest of that. I'm gonna have this for lunches this week. I'm gonna be doing some turkey and apple and Gouda um, sandwiches this week for lunch, one or two days. And then I needed the uncured smoked turkey bacon for egg muffin cups as well. So that is all I needed for proteins. I picked up some garbanzo beans. I'm gonna be making a smashed chickpea salad that I'm gonna have on rice cakes for lunch this week. I will be sharing that with you in meal prep also. I needed some buffalo wing sauce. I go through this quite a bit because I love it so much. I'm gonna be using this for a buffalo chicken salad, like a buffalo chicken chop salad that I'm gonna be having and I will be sharing that with you. I'm gonna do a whole video this week with just my dinners in it. So I will be showing you how I put that together. I picked up some unsweetened vanilla almond milk. I'm gonna be doing some chia puddings for snacks this week. So I'll show that in my meal prep tomorrow. Fat-free half and half for coffee. Blue cheese dressing. This is the Bolt House Farms. I really like this blue cheese dressing. Then I picked up three of the Oikos yogurts. I wanted to eat more protein this week. Um, I'm doing intermittent fasting and so I noticed that I um, I feel like I need more protein because I want to stay fuller longer So I, and I've been craving it. So I picked up the strawberry, which I don't think I've ever gotten the strawberry in this. And then orange cream is one of my favorites and pineapple is probably my second favorite. I picked up some of the Greek yogurt cream cheese. This is a lot less um, calories and points than the like third less fat cream cheese. I'm gonna be making some jalapeno popper egg muffins and so I needed that for this. And then I picked up just, I actually picked up two of the RX bars. I had one of them I broke my fast with this afternoon after I got done shopping, but this is one I have left. I'll just keep it in my cupboard. I needed the sun-dried tomatoes. I think this is, yeah, this is also for one of the egg muffin um, recipes. This is the smoked kind, it's so good. Um, these are zero points because they are only just tomatoes. There's no oil or anything with them. Picked up bacon bits. This is gonna be for one of the egg muffin cup recipes as well. And then the family, like I said, is having chef salads one day this week, so the rest of them will go for that. This is probably my favorite lunch meat. This was on sale this week. I like to either get it cut from the deli or I buy it like this at the deli, that they've cut it themselves. Um, this is one point for one ounce. This is so good. I like to have this on rice cakes, which is how I'm gonna have it this week, or on like the um, Acmac sesame crackers. So either one, but this is the best lunch meat. It's so good. I picked up one of the Amy's burritos. I'll probably have this for lunch one day this week. These are like six or seven points. So these are really good. This is the organic beans and rice with the cheddar cheese. These are the sandwich thins. I have a lot of people ask me about these now. I know that the, I think it's Aura Weed is what we have around here, or Franz. They now were like three or four points for some of their sandwich slims. This is the one from Fred Meyer, which as I tell you guys every week, um, we have Fred Meyer here. Kroger is their parent company. The multi-grain of this brand is only two smart points for these. This is when we're having my apple, turkey, and gouda sandwiches on. And I may also use this for the buffalo um, chicken breast. I'm not sure. But anyway, these are really good and only two smart points. I just picked up some coffee. I change up my coffee every week depending on what's on sale. And then the mandarin oranges. And this is in their own juice. I'll be using this for some wonton salads that I'm having for dinner one day this week. This zesty fat-free Italian. I love to use this on my like pasta salad. I'm going to be kind of mixing up my pasta salad. I shared that pasta salad with you guys in that summer cookout barbecue video, um, but I'm gonna mix it up a little bit and add a bunch of summer veggies. I found a recipe on Pinterest. I'm gonna kind of use that as my inspiration, but this is the dressing I love to use for that. But again, I will be showing that in a video this week, so I'll show you how I put all that together. Another addition to that recipe is going to be these roasted bell pepper strips. These are in water. You wanna really check these because a lot of these are in oil as well. This is only water and citric acid and salt, I believe. 
So these are really good. These are the deli sliced ones. So this will be in that salad as well. I picked up some rainbow carrots. I'm sorry guys, if this is like messed up, it's because my camera for some reason keeps shutting off and I don't know why I keep having to restart the video. So I'm hoping that it doesn't, when I go to edit, there's not anything weird as far when it cuts off, but sorry about that. I picked up some mint. I thought I'd try this in my lemon water this week. I thought that sounded really refreshing. It's been so hot here that I thought some lemon and some mint in my water would be good. So I'm gonna try that. Pico de Gallo, this is gonna be for, I'm gonna have some turkey, taco salads like the turkey meat taco meat taco taco turkey meat <laughs> i'm gonna have that with this and i think i needed this for something else as well i can't remember what else but anyway pick that up i uh, just picked up the stir fry kit i won't be using the sauce but what i like to do with this is steam this with my vegetables so this all because i like how this has like kale in it and also just some shredded up brussels sprouts things like that so what I will do is steam this in the steamer basket with my other vegetables. That, that sounds really good. Jalapenos, again, this is for the jalapeno popper egg muffins I'm going to be making. Lemons for my water. Avocados for everything. Tomatoes for that summer salad. Oh, I just realized I forgot to get red cabbage. When I saw my red onion, I realized I forgot to get red cabbage. Um, red onion for the salad and for other things. Cauliflower, I'm gonna steam this up and have it for a side one day this week. Also, I'm using that in the summer salad. Bananas for the chia pudding and for snacking. Cucumbers for snacking. A zucchini is for that summer vegetable salad. Broccoli is for the summer vegetable salad and I like to just steam these and have them as a side dish. So I'll steam, what I'll do is I'll steam this, this, and the cauliflower, and then I have some, the green beans I showed you guys in the earlier clip. I'll, I'll steam all three of those together and have them as a side dish. Summer squash the same way. This is for the um, summer vegetable salad. Celery is for the smashed, uh, smashed, what was I gonna say? Oh, smashed chickpea salad sandwiches. I'm gonna have, but I'm gonna have them on rice cakes. And then green onions. I picked up some more of the golden beets. I'm just gonna roast these up. I'm also gonna try steaming them and see how they are. I might steam them with the rest of those vegetables and see what happens, but I'm not sure if that'll work. I'm gonna have to Google that because I don't know enough about these but these are the golden beets and they're really, really good. So I'm gonna have those um, probably roasted if not steamed. So there you go guys, here is my grocery haul for the week. As usual, stay tuned at the end of the video and I will have all my meal plans for lunches and dinners. But I, like I said, I am gonna be doing a separate lunch video and a separate dinner video this week. Again, as usual, thank you for watching. If you are new here, I hope you will stick around and subscribe. I do grocery hauls every single week. Also, stay tuned for Sunday's meal prep. So I will have a meal prep up and I have all new recipes in that meal prep. So looking forward to sharing that with you as well. So thank you all for watching and I will see you all in the next video. Bye guys.